My name is Nate DeLeon, and I have the privilege of working in the Signals Intelligence Directorate, or SIGINT, at the NRO. SIGINT is the exploitation of the enemy's use of the electromagnetic spectrum. So for practical use, the radars and the invisible waves that ships and airplanes use to look around, by being able to understand their behaviors or their employment, it can directly trace to our leadership's understanding of how the enemy operates. We achieved the SIGINT mission by placing extremely sensitive receivers looking down at the earth to track those behaviors and listen to them. We do this in the form of a satellite. SIGINT supports the overall mission because oftentimes it's SIGINT that's the first to know that there's some activity that we need to pay attention to. What's really difficult about it though is the target set, as in being the RF spectrum, is constantly changing. So there's a lot of variables to consider. Bottom line is we're listening to the bad guys from space. By listening, we're then able to inform our leadership and our decision makers of what moves to make next but then we also inform the direct warfighter at the tactical level. My job is to inject upgrades for space protection onto a vehicle that's already being built. So think of purchasing a car in the year 2000 for it to be delivered in 2004. Now while they're bolting the doors on, you realize that there's this new capability called Bluetooth. My job is to assess that need, understand what the requirement is or what Bluetooth is gonna grant you, and then understand how to integrate it into the system the best way possible. What's innovative about SIGINT is despite the fact that these spacecraft take a very long time to create, we will continue to inject capability. This is called evolutionary acquisitions. What this allows us to do is to stay nimble with the times and ensure that we get the most out of our investment for every launch. SIGINT delivers versatile, robust, resilient, and capable assets to the warfighter, to our multinational partners, and to the nation. These capabilities are having direct impact today. Imagine what we can do for the future.